Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Let's Play Hexen with Soon. I believe we're on the final stretch here, heading towards the end of the game. Awfully generous of the game to give me that many quartz flasks. Hmm. <clears throat> There we go. Huh. Must be like a mana spawning device or something. Yep. Well, there he is. made of. It's that little bitch. Give me these. going on again. Nice. How many times can I do this before it just screws me over, I wonder? Apparently a lot. <clears throat> oh, okay, there it is. Figured it was only a matter of time. That sucks. I'm just gonna die here. <laughs> I couldn't cycle to the item I wanted to. Okay. Awesome. Apparently my, my mouse got stuck there too. Alright. Let's do this again. Only this time. Okay. Use one of those. One too many. Whatever, I'm just gonna leave it there.
<laughs> it's pretty cool. Nice to see the sword actually doing some good, finally. Not to say that it was bad or anything, but... There's a whole lot of teleporting going on there. Okay. Racers. Boots. Mana. Icon. Die, you bastard. Wow. Icon of the Defender kind of makes this a little bit easy, doesn't it? <laughs> it's kind of stupid. Well... I think that's all she wrote. Can't exactly open these, so guess we'll go through here and see what happens. Oh. Alrighty. With a scream of agony, you are wrenched from this world into another. I'm gonna stop reading for a second so I can let it scroll across. I'm not reading too fast. Every part of your body wreathed in mystic fire. When your vision clears, you find yourself standing on standing in a great hall filled with ghostly echoes and menacing shadows. In the distance you can see a raised dais and upon it the only source of light in this world. This can only be the Chaos Sphere, the source of Korax's power. With this, you can create worlds or destroy them. By rights of battle and conquest, it is yours, and with trembling hands, you reach out to grasp it. Perhaps now, a new player will join the cosmic game of power. Like the pawn who is promoted to queen, suddenly the very reaches of the board seem to be within your grasp. <laughs> but there are other players mightier than than you and who can know their next moves well it's not going to another screen so I would imagine that's it well guys, that's, this concludes my let's play of Hexen Beyond Heretic. Um, the next game I have planned is Dungeons of Dreadmore. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do after that, um, so we'll see. Thanks everybody for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next series.